Hello everybody and welcome back to Asagao Academy Normal Boots Club. I have a frog in my throat apparently. I have been recording for like an hour and a half so I think that's probably understandable. Anyways, uh, last time we uh, attended a radio show of PB&J. Yep. That was pretty well it. Yep. Oh, I guess we also remembered that Peanut Butter Gamer was, in fact, our childhood friend. Right at the beginning of the episode. Anyways. This time we woke up and found a... Or last time, at the very end, we woke up and found a, a love letter. And then we read it, and it's... Uh, three lines long. I think it's a... a I almost said a haiku. That's that's a Naruto character. Uh, a haiku, maybe. Five seven five. So pretty you are. You are kind of like the ocean. It's snowing on Mount Fuji. Yeah, that sounds about right. Mm. Yeah. Uh. This is terrible. Who do you think wrote it? PVG? No, definitely not. Who says it's for me anyways? It says right here, you're kind of like the ocean. Mm. What, and you're not? Plus your eyes are green. I actually right clicked and it didn't go up to the save menu, which is wonderful. I shouldn't even draw attention to it. Forget I said anything. Hmm, you know, this poem... It's so generic, it could literally apply to anyone. This is so stupid. Man, what kind of love poem is this? You have to be specific, like, I love your ex... Let me just sound this out. Effervescence. Effervescent. There we go. I love your effervescent sparkle in the mold just under your left armpit. What? And you would sign it too. Apparently she just went to narrator voice. And you would sign it too. Whoever wrote this isn't even worth it. <laughs> sure it wasn't PVG? No! Why, of course not. It's just... This doesn't seem like him. But... If it was from him, we did go to the festival together. Fuck you. Fuck you. Fuck your father. Fuck your father. Fuck your father. He didn't seem interested then, and he only just got close again. I frowned. PBG sending me a love poem? The thought sat in my chest like a wet blanket. <clears throat> uh, whatever. She grabbed the letter and threw it on her desk. Unless this p the person learns how to write, let's not even bother. As she turned to grab a clothes, she muttered, muttered to herself. I accidentally right-clicked the mouse again? Uh, fuck you. Jared would write a way better poem than that. Because you know he's a model, so uh, clearly he is totally literate. Just like all models. They're beautiful with their words. Uh, sure. I started filling my bag with books for class. PBG still hovering in my mind. Really, though, what if? As soon as I walked in the door of the classroom, a tall ball of nervous energy greeted me. Good morning. <laughs> uh, uh, Hannah, hey. He was bouncing up and down on his heels and smiling like a chest shy a cat. I don't even know what that is. I press right click again. What the fuck? I'm just gonna move my finger right off the right button. I felt fingers trail across my shoulders as my walked past. <laughs> Told you so. I immediately flushed. PBG. Um peanut butter gamer what's up 
well, uh, first game is coming up. I just thought I'd put on this sexy voice. Well, our first game is coming up. It still has that English accent. Well, our first game is coming up. Yeah, I remember you saying something about that before. I'd really like it if you could come. From a clock across the classroom, I heard my snigger. Yeah. Uh, yeah, sure, I'll, I'll come. It'll, I'll definitely come and cheer you on. He clapped his hands together, but it was weak and wimpy and sounded too, too trebly. Not enough bass, I'd say. Adventure! Really? <laughs> That's the voice clip he used. That's great. It's, it's great. This, this, this will be an adventure. Sorry. An adventure. And then slow zoom in on his face as it fades to another picture of him running in the woods with a Zelda. A Zelda. A Link outfit on. I was thinking about the game. I wasn't mistaking the two. Just in case you want to swarm me with horrible, hateful comments. Soccer makes me really happy, so I'm glad we can share it together. Uh, me... Me too. I hope you do well. Break a leg! Or... Oh, wait. Do they say that in soccer? <laughs> they do if you say it. Um... Uh... Well, uh... Good luck. I'm just gonna... I dashed to my desk and slammed myself into my chair. Moments later, PBG slid into his chair, too. Well, isn't that sweet? My, I'm, I'm sure it's not <laughs> romantic. Ho! Oh! Wow, that, that peaked the mic. Great. But I still don't think he's the one who wrote the poem. What are you talking about? You heard him on the radio. He saw how you you saw how nervous he was just now. Yeah, but someone else could have taken his advice. His advice. You said yourself that everyone listens to BB and J. He's only nervous because the first big game is coming up. He's crazy about soccer. You know that. Yeah, soccer, games, and peanut butter. I get it. I don't know what the peanut butter... I don't know that the peanut butter is really part of it. What? What? But it's his actual name. Have you ever actually seen him eat any? I mean, if it is actually his parents' given name, or his birth given name, then... I don't see how that has anything to do with him liking peanut butter. I mean, I guess he could have changed his name because he liked peanut butter so much, but that's... That's really special if that's the case. Well, now that you mention it, no, but... Glass. You would do well to shut your yaps today, or I will attack you. I will straight up fucking assault you. I don't give a shit. <sighs> you know, there is something precious and beautiful about your youngsters finding love. She slammed a hand onto the desk, driving her nails into it. <clears throat> yes, so beautiful how even filth and sixth graders can meet. I'm sorry, sixth graders? Fifth and sixth graders. I'm sorry? What? I was under the conception that we were, like, at least 17 years old. Are we 5th and 6th graders? Because that's... That's a little weird. Gotta say, some of these people have beards. Just straight up beards. What the hell? How even 5th and 6th graders can meet. Cross racial boundaries, capture magical cards, and fall, fall in love together. It's just so fucking great. They actually follow through on their promise to love each other in the future. Ugh. 
So find someone to love when you're while you're young, or <laughs> all good men will be snatched up. Really, that's interesting. She grabbed a piece of chalk and started vigorously drawing a diagram of Summoner's Rift. Why? We were all skipping right to geography. Well, whatever kept us from imminent death was fine by me. Go get him, PBG! <laughs> One overbearing applause later. Yes! Yes! Anna! Anna! Uh -huh. Stuff it in his creamer! <laughs> what does that even mean? Is it like his dick? I don't know. It was the day of PBGs and Asagao's first soccer game. It was bright and hot and the team was in rough shape. Hair matted foreheads, sweat dripped down backs and they kept playing. The score was 1-2 against Hatterful. I'm... I'm sorry? I'm sorry, is that... Is that the bird school? Is that is that is that the, is that the bird school, the school of birds, yeah. the the bird the bird school, yeah. Had a full high, yeah. Like from had a full boyfriend, boyfriend. Hmm. Yep. I couldn't tell whether it was the heat or my excitement, but. Every now and then I swore I saw the other players shift into something like birds. Yep, that's confirmed. Fucking confirmed. But when I told my... Um. That is the single weirdest thing I've ever heard. A high school filled with birds? I played it off as a joke. Right now the, bal the balloon. The balloon! It's a balloon. The ball was in the other team's court, or field Heck, on the other side of the field anyways how did people play soccer again no! what the fuck is with these audio levels watch out one of the players shot the ball again at the goal mm. block it block it block it block it block it the goalie an older student who kind of resembled pbg caught the ball oh thank goodness I put a hand on my chest to try and calm my rapidly beating heart. Hey, Hana! I didn't know you were so into soccer, Hana. <laughs> I didn't either. PBG, originally on the first side of the field, jogged back to the middle. As a forward, I think he said his job was to shoot the ball, basically, or something. He's a striker. He shoots on the he shoots on the net. The other team called a timeout. As he waited, PBG turned to the stand, scanning the crowd. He paused his eyes, skimmed over me, then beamed and waved. He could probably see my hair from a mile away. I was just about to comment on that. I waved back. Yeah. You can do it. I believe in you. Do it for me. I'm ready for you. She said, rubbing her crotch. That was a little too far. I took a brief look of a brief look of surprise across my face, and he gave me a thumbs up. Guess he's into it. Oh, they're starting again. Sorry. Ellipses. Ellipses. It was nearly the end of the game. Huh. The score was 1-2, to two, but this time, Hasegao had the ball. Jeff was dribbling it up the side of the field. Someone got in his way, and he passed the ball to Dean, the center forward. Dean dodged left and right. Only ten seconds left. They were coming closer and closer to the goal. It's hard to make reading exciting. Dean here. Ugh. Dean glanced up at PBG, but as someone stepped in front of him, he reflexively clicked. Clicked. Kicked the ball towards Jeff. No! 
the fuck does it matter? Jeez. As long as he gets the goal. No! The ball was intercepted from a play by a player from high to full high. There we go. That's, that's, there, there's the problem right there. As the timer ticked down, all the spirit left the Asagao team. The crowd around me clapped politely as the other team cheered. The first game of the season was a loss. People rose to leave, obscuring my vision of PBG. I stepped onto the bleachers, but still... <coughs> I'm so damn short. It's fine. We'll meet him out on the field. Gerard, Mai, and I waited until most of the sweaty crowd passed, then walked to the edge of the field. The team was crowded in a circle, just a few feet away. Next time. I don't feel bad. Overall, we had a really good game. We should do more team drills, I think, and a bit of work on our passing, so it doesn't happen again, though. So it doesn't happen again, though. Sure, why not? Our next game. We should probably head back. What? Why? Huh. When PBG gets like this, it takes them forever to come back to the real world. Once it took us two hours just to get him off the field. Ech. 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 Yeah, let's go. We turned and immediately... And immediately yellow jackets filled our vision. Hey. Oh, uh, hey guys. Bummer about the game, right? Ugh. That other team had us on our toes the whole time. Couldn't believe it. <sighs> Yeah, it was pretty upsetting. I hope PBG's alright. Just for reference, I believe that this is Balrog, and I think this is Youngtown. I think. A gleam appeared in Luke's eyes. <laughs> PBG, I'm, I'm sure he'll, he'll be fine. I don't like that look. Well... There's always next game, though. This one shouldn't hurt us too bad, as long as we win the rest. No pressure, though. <sighs> yeah, no pressure. Would PBG be alright? An odd noise came from Luke, and he cleared his throat. Catch you on the flippity flip. Anyways, dude, we gotta go. Like, we'll see you all later. What? Wait, we do? Yeah, dude, let's go. Later. If you say so. Bye, guys. That was odd. Don't mind them. They're always strange. Huh? Wait. Were they acting weird? I didn't... I didn't notice anything. <laughs> Case in point. Bye-bye. Anyways, I have volleyball practice, so I should get going. I have to head out too, but speaking of practice, are you keeping up with the puzzle game? Uh, uh oh, oh, yeah, uh, t totally. It's great. I'm, I'm learning a lot. Uh, good. The tournament's in only a month, so give it your best. Yeah. I, I will. Yeah. Catch you later. He said it himself. Ellipses. I should go practice. I think we're going to stop right there with this wonderful music in the background. Anyways. If you like the video, feel free to like the video. If you dislike the video, feel free to dislike the video. You can also comment on the video. You can also favorite the video. You can also share the video on social media. You can also follow me on social media, and of course, if you really want to get some wonderful content from me, if you want, if you want more of this shitty content, this wonderful, wonderful, mm, wonderful content, feel free to subscribe. In fact, do subscribe. Just do it. I don't care if you don't want to. Just do it.
anyways, thank you everybody for watching. I'm the Morbid Hobo. Goodbye.